Hello guys and welcome back again in another automation video in another actually requested video this is the new update that they featured the automation with uh, they, 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 they did a lot of fixes and a lot of uh, game crash fixes yes yeah, so now the game has less bugs and less uh, less problems and I, I've heard also and I, I've heard from the developers that they added 150 uh, bodies uh, body shells for the sandbox, uh, you know, uh, car designing features, not the engine. So I'm gonna try and make another video for it after this one. So this is a requested video, which is the biggest inline four with the highest horsepower in this game. So this is an easy request. It's not really that difficult. I mean, just pop everything to the max. But it's a it's a good video. I mean, uh, what's the biggest inline four ever made? Of course, it's bigger than 5.4 liters, but let's make the biggest one in this game. So, starting when it was starting with inline four aluminium silicon, and the bore is 120 millimeters, and the stroke is 120 millimeters. So this is the max size this game can support. Dual overhead camshaft, five valves per cylinder, aluminium silicon again. Next. Billet steel for max RPM, titanium lightweight, the lightweight forged, and plus 15 for the highest quality. What else? Uh, the compression ratio I'm gonna stick to 9.5 to 1 because I'm gonna make it uh, turbocharged. As you can see right now, the icons, the icons, has been has changed. Yes, new update. Quite like them now. Right, the cam profile I'm gonna stick to racing as per start. VVT for all cams plus 15 again. Turbocharged and ball bearing large let's, let's stick with the performance but i'm gonna tweak it later plus 15 again injection direct injection now that's new per cylinder yes they changed the world per cylinder performance uh, ultimate fuel hmm right what else what else I wish if they can add the feature here that you can change the color of the head of the valve covers, but it's not available yet. It's available in the old version, but not this one. So the fuel or the fuel mixtures uh, is 13 and a half. Uh, the ignition timing. Let's stick with 50 for a start and 6,000 6, as a start for for this engine. But I'm gonna increase it if, if I can. High flow three-way, and the exhaust side should be humongous. As you can see, also the graphics are a little bit different. They are a little bit sharper, and uh, you know the shining, the shine, and uh, you know the aluminium or the stainless steel, stainless steel looking semi to the real one, like the real, one, like, like the real deal. Now, a muffler straight through, no need for another one. As you can see, and that what I was afraid of because la super large engines doesn't rev that much high. So we have to decrease the the RPM so we can make it so we can make it absolutely reliable. I mean, 4,200 RPM only. That's the limit of this engine. So, but if I increase it more, the engine, the engine will start to hurt itself, and it will explode at the end. Right. Let's start tweak it. Tweaking it. All right, the camshaft doesn't have to be that big because the engine doesn't rev that much high, so we can decrease the size of it. Right, this is perfect like this. 69. Now the turbocharger. Um, I'm, 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 I'm aiming for the highest power, so let's see how much we can really. Wow, decrease decreasing the size of the turbo. Makes more power. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Decreasing the size of the turbine. Increase. No, that. Right. Boost. Everyone loves boost. I'm addicted to boost. Let's see how hard can we push it. Uh, ah, crumb. damn it. The pistons. I don't want to change it back to forge because this will decrease the RPM as you can see now it, it will only rev to 4000 <sighs> all right so 4000 because I want more torque as you can see the crank can take 1276 pound-feet 
same here and now the same here so this is the perfect combination if you are aiming for a high torque engine but if you want a high rpm you should use the lightweight forged but uh, two, two, 200 rpms doesn't really shave that much horsepower from the engine so let's continue um, let's see increasing the size now yes that does that does the trick no I'm pr I, I always prefer to put the turbine size small and decrease the AR ratio yes as you can see now the torque can go up to the to the max mm. now the boost again let's see how much we can boost this beast now I'm gonna keep a, a, a little room for the ignition timing never forget about the ignition timing ah oh, man yes now let's add fuel economy is not really important now right go ignition timing go 1000 pound feet of torque right that's perfect I want I mean the wow the engine is laggy look at the lag and then it only start at 3000 up to 4000 1000 rpm that's pathetic <sighs> I wish I could make this engine st I wish I could make the torque start a little bit early, earlier but I have to stick a, a smaller turbo let's see how small can we go 70 and stick it 70 again decreased AR ratio let's see I want to talk engine is running really rich right now yes let's decrease the mixture I mean if I want a torque engine I would stick it like this to start from 2000 rpm because this is the torque that uh, basically this is not an engine for any car I think I mean yes it, it can fit in in, in, a, in, a, in some big in some big SUVs or something but I think this engine is suitable as a generator a big electric electricity generator as you can see here if I want to make this engine make torque and and doesn't really serve it doesn't really if you burn much fuel I can uh, make the torque start up to uh, even 1500 or 2000 and use less fuel than this but this won't be as the request as the requested video so I'm gonna have to get back again to the max horsepower sorry guys I, I know the, the the turbo is lagging so much and the engine is burning so much fuel but this is the request and I have to stick to it max horsepower max horsepower right max horsepower right increasing the tire turbo size I mean I wish really 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 wish this engine can can rev higher but no this engine cannot rev in a bit a bit higher because it will start to destroy itself and let's see ignition timing is 100 the fuel is at max the the boost boost ka boost right go 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 40 come on 40 psi yes that's it. You can now you can now tell everyone that you never asked me how much boost how much boost is in this engine and my on my response all of it just put the needle to the max will not do anything and let's see any changes here yes so this engine basically will always run at max RPM if you want more power. You have to run it at max always, or at least from if you want the max torque 3500. Hmm. Let's try and decrease the compression ratio a little bit and the camshafts. That is where 
right, like that. 55 is now better. 888 horsepower and 1199. Oh yes, the exhaust! I always forget about the exhaust, man, come on. Exhaust is still um, restricted, restriction. Still have some restrictions. I have to decrease the compression ratio a little bit and increase the size of the exhaust. A look at that power! Wow! Oh my god, look, even with everything cranked to the max quality, the engine is still eating itself because of the high torque 1300 and 4 pound feet of torque. Ah, what a shame, I really... Even, even, with the, even with these errors here, the engine is still reliable. Look at the, look at the reliability, 86.4. Wow, I'm impressed. Increasing the right, and what else do we have here? Let's try it. I, 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 I bet you all want to hear it and see it. Oh my god. I, I bet you all want to see it and hear it. Right. As you all know before the the game oh so now the engine can now the engine is now okay will keep on running even if the even if it, if you, even if you turn it off okay so as you all know the game always get choppy when you put turbocharger on an engine and uh, play with it for a long time when you run it uh, you will see uh, you will see if I move this needle the game will get choppy and as you can see here on the turbo look at the lighting here and the shadows. It's not really, it's not really, really smooth. It, because I, uh, not because I'm running the game on ultra or epic as they call as they call it in the op option menu, but I don't know what the hell happened here. Always this same error as you can see here. Look, look at the lighting here and the shadow is dropping. So I hope they can fix it in the future. I mean, look at the exhaust side. The exhaust size is really, really ridiculous, but the engine really makes the, oh, nearly 1,000 horsepower. And let's see if we can crank it up to 1,000. How much room do we have? Wow, now we have 1000 and... I can still crank it up. Wow. So this is the max of this engine. Right. 1014 horsepower and 1331 pound feet of torque ooh that's this engine is making i mean look at the, the these indi these indicators here they they are saying that the indicate crank stress caused by high torque lowering reliability i mean the crank will not uh, not get destroyed or this 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 engine will not will not be shattered to 100 million pieces but 
because the, it's this it's good it has a it has a good reliability value uh, the economy never 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 look at the, this gauge here and the octane is nearly 100 the emissions are good for its power and um, yes the material costs are humongously expensive well, uh, this engine really requires a lot of work to make and this engine I mean yes it it, it has 80 86 uh, 86 reliability points but Oh, so not 86, 82.4 reliability points, but you cannot use engine this engine as a daily driving engine, and this engine has low low RPM, and the, the turbo is so laggy. But this is a requested engine, uh, and I love request requests, if, even if they are crazy. So I hope you really enjoyed this engine, guys. Uh, it's a crazy idea, yes, and uh, it's not, this engine is much crazier as the 40 psi um, racing engine because this one has 43 psi. So I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Please, if you if you enjoyed it, please hit that like button. And if you are not a subscriber, please subscribe to enjoy more cool videos like this one. Also, uh, I love to I love if you guys uh, could request more engines because lately some of you guys has been request request good crazy requests, but the most of you guys I mean 200 subscriber. Come on, guys, request. Come on, don't be shy. If you have a crazy request, crazy scheme request, just tell me. And if the game supports it, I will make it. And if the game cannot support it, I can make something similar. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. I will see you in another video after this one, uh, exploring the new body shells uh, as the game as the game update has been released. Thank you so much. Goodbye.